come on, come on, come on. Hold him, hold him, hold him. Hold him, hold him. Come on. Jesus. Wow. That's great. These are the people that we need to follow them. I mean, these are the pastors that we need to follow them. We will continue. But I want to tell you something. That when you listen to this message, you are totally blessed. Keep on listening to this message. And your life will never be the same. Let's continue. God bless you. Did more than that at the cross. That is not all that Jesus died for. He didn't die for you to fall. He died that you may rise up. Somebody shout hallelujah. He didn't die. So you can laugh. <laughs> Jesus died for more than that. He didn't die so you can have religious celebration. He died so that when you pass the street, Peter, I touch your clothes, my eyes. Opened. Oh. Peter, I'm lame. Hey, I touch you. Now I'm healed. Hey, I'm so glad I was weak. When you passed me, I became strong. That is the gift to the church. Jesus didn't die so we can jump seven times. <laughs> Jesus didn't die so that a black man can become white or so that a white man can become red. He died that our body, soul, and spirit may change. Somebody say hallelujah. The baton, the baton, must not fall in your hand. Paul gave it to Peter. Peter gave it to Idahosa. Idahosa gave it to Gary. Gary must give it to someone. So that when our generation aspires, those coming behind us will say, we've never seen it in this fashion. The blind see. The deaf hear. The lame walk. And to the poor, Pakamoso, the gospel is preached. That is the good news. Not when you come from service. How was it? I fell four times. Oh. You fell blind. You got up blind. What are you falling for? How was the service, brother? I was on the floor for five hours. So when you got up, what happened? <laughs> oh. <laughs> if that is why Jesus died, his blood was shed in vain. It's more than that. He died and rose that the church might Hold to captivity, principalities and powers. Can I hear you say amen? amen. 